Hey guys, it's Renee. So today I thought I would share with you how to make this leopard hoop earrings using clay. I'm going to be using this porcelain clay. You can use polymer clay as well. You don't need that much actually. I'm just going to be rolling this into a shape of a really thin sausage or snake. And before this dries, because this dries uh, with air, I'm just going to be taking this red sippy cap mini one and I'm just going to roll it around that. Actually, I've done another video like this one, but showing you in depth how I make like hoop earrings out of clay. It's on my channel if you want to check it out. But yeah, once this is done and dry, I'm going to be cutting those parts where the uh, like ear pods is gonna be. Then I'm going to be taking some ear pods, and since this come with this kind of like donuts uh, around them, I'm just going to remove that part, and then I'm just going to be gluing that small part in there to make this an earring. So I painted them in gold for that video that I just mentioned, but I'm going to be painting them again. For that, I'm going to be using this vintage white and I'm just going to be covering this, giving this a couple of coats. Then for this part, I'm going to be making this copper shade using this antique copper that I have on the right, which is kind of like reddish for my taste, and this gold acrylic paint. I'm going to be mixing those two. And then I'm just going to be using a small brush and I'm just going to be marking the spots all over the place. But yeah, then I'm going to be taking uh, my black acrylic paint and my tiny brush and I'm just going to be working on the edges of like the spots of leopard. Pretty much making them as imperfect as I can because the less perfect that you make them, the cooler they look. I also make them like thicker. Yeah, don't be afraid of that black. I feel like if you're shaking, it looks even better. And then because I seem to think backwards when it comes to my DIYs, I sometimes want to add something that makes more sense to add at the beginning. So if you're going to be adding this step, just feel free to add it before you paint anything. But I'm just going to be taking my clay and my roller with my space bands. I do have the DIY for those. Those are there so that I can have like the same thickness on my clay. I'm going to be cutting two stripes out of that and I'm just going to be placing them on the edges. This is just to add some like detail on like the edges. Then I'm going to be adding a small tiny ball from like clay and I'm just going to be pushing that in there just so that it looks uh, smoother. Then I'm going to be painting this one in gold, giving this a few coats until it's big enough. Then again, I just uh, felt like it needed something and I just went ahead and added a few uh, like black spots all over the place. As a final step, I'm just going to be adding some gloss, uh, glaze gloss by Sculpey, giving this a few coats until it's done. And I feel like this gloss just brings the sign together, it makes it look like better, I feel like, I think. But there guys, these are the earrings that I want to share with you. I honestly really like them. I think they look super cute, fun, but not over the top. They are kind of like a statement if you want them to be, but I feel like they are kind of like a subtle statement. They don't look as crazy. They look like, I think, I feel like, hopefully, they look like leopard print. But yeah, guys, I really hope you liked them. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Check out more earrings that I have on my channel and subscribe for more. And let me know what you think of this ones. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you later and take care. Bye, guys.